Hey guys, it's Joanna, Naturally Motivated Lady, and today I'm going to answer a few of the most common questions that I get regarding my locks. And before we get started, just a quick reminder to not miss out on the countdown sale of Life Lessons in Locks. It ends at midnight Eastern time on Tuesday, September 8th, and I'm excited to say that it is now a number one bestseller. So thank you to everyone who picked up a copy and left the review. And if you haven't grabbed a copy, feel free to take a second right now to go ahead and click on the link in the description box to get a 60% discount before the price goes back to normal. So now let's answer some of these questions. In fact, I took these questions directly from my YouTube channel, Naturally Motivated Lady. Question one is, how many locks do you have? Most of the time, people think that I have more locks than I actually have. I counted them several years ago and I still had the same number today. I haven't lost any locks. I have 193, so no, I don't have three, four, or 500 locks. And I like it this way because I self-maintain my hair. And around 200 locks, it gives me the small or micro locks look without having to sacrifice so much of my time for maintenance. Along the same lines, another question that I often get is how long does it take to interlock your hair? How long does it take to interlock? Now I've been locked for just over four years now and years ago it could easily take me five or six hours and that was because I was new to interlocking and not very fast at it. But over the past year or two, I can get it done in about two hours if I just sit down and focus on getting it done. Another common question is, what are your length goals or how long do you plan on growing your locks? Well, my initial goal was to just grow my locks to the length of my loose natural hair when it was stretched out or, or straightened. At the longest, it was about, about mid-back length. So I've actually already met that first goal. And at the moment, I'm just going to let it continue to grow. My hair is still very lightweight and I don't even notice the weight of it unless it's wet. So right now, I guess my next goal would be somewhere between waist length and hip length, just to experience it and see how I like it. I'll answer just a couple more questions in this video to keep it brief. So the next question is, have you ever experienced buildup in your locks? There have been some occasions where I find lint in my locks that I have to try and pick out but product buildup has not been a problem for me. That's mainly because I avoid using any products that I know could leave buildup in my locks. That brings us to the last question here. What products do you use? I talked about this in detail in a previous video, but I use a clarifying shampoo and a moisturizing spritz that's pretty much made up of water and oils. And if you'd like to check out that video to see how I make it, the video is called what products to use to moisturize locks. And I'll put a link for that as well in the description box. But let me know please what questions you would like to have answered. And that way I can make more videos like this to either answer your questions or try to point you in the right direction to find the answer. And don't forget to pick up your discounted copy of Life Lessons and Locks if you haven't already done so. Thumbs up the video and subscribe so that you can see my future content. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.